Welcome to Holistic Wellness 24-7. In today's video, we're looking at Bruce Lee's legacy, Power Balance Harmony 2024. Whether you're looking to cleanse, revitalize, or enhance your wellness, you've come to the right place. In this video, we'll explore the topic of Bruce Lee's most powerful lesson, the importance of balance and harmony in life. As one of the greatest martial artists and philosophers, Bruce Lee believed that achieving harmony within ourselves and with the world around us is essential for personal growth and success. By the end, you'll have a clear, simple roadmap to improve your well-being step by step. My videos focus on the how-to of expanding your lifespan and more importantly, your health span, how you can now transform your life. So let's get started. The world spins faster than ever. Deadlines loom, notifications buzz. We are constantly bombarded with information, tasks and responsibilities. Our minds are perpetually racing, trying to keep up with the relentless pace of modern life. It's easy to feel swept away in the current of modern life. The hustle and bustle can be overwhelming, leaving us feeling disconnected and frazzled. We often find ourselves yearning for a moment of peace, a brief respite from the chaos. But what if I told you there's a way to find peace amidst the chaos? A way to carve out a sanctuary of stillness even in the most turbulent of times? Imagine being able to center yourself to find a calm within the storm that rages around you. A way to move through life with grace and intention even when it feels like the ground is constantly shifting beneath your feet. This isn't just a dream, it's a practice, a discipline that can be cultivated. It's about learning to navigate the ebb and flow of life with a sense of purpose and tranquility. This is the legacy of Bruce Lee, a man who mastered not only the art of combat, but also the art of living. Bruce Lee's philosophy wasn't just about physical prowess. It was about mental and spiritual strength. He believed in the power of the mind to shape our reality. Bruce Lee's teachings offer a roadmap to navigating life's complexities. His wisdom provides us with tools to cultivate inner peace and resilience. Through his words and actions, he showed us that true mastery comes from within. He understood that true strength comes from within, from cultivating balance and harmony in all aspects of our being. It's about finding equilibrium between our inner and outer worlds, between our thoughts and actions. This is not a passive pursuit, but an active engagement with the world around us. It's about being fully present in each moment, embracing both the challenges and the joys that life brings. It's about learning to flow with the currents rather than fighting against them. A dance between strength and flexibility, between action and stillness. Bruce Lee's life and teachings remind us that we have the power to find stillness in the storm, to create a sense of peace and purpose amidst the chaos. It's a journey of self-discovery, a path to true inner strength. Bruce Lee was more than just a martial arts icon. He was a philosopher, a teacher and a visionary. His legacy transcends the silver screen, reaching into the depths of human potential. He challenged us to question our limitations, to push beyond our perceived boundaries and to embrace the fullness of who we are. Lee's impact on martial arts is undeniable. He revolutionized fighting styles, blending techniques and philosophies from various disciplines. Jeet Kune Do, his own unique style, embodies the essence of adaptability and self-expression. But his impact extends far beyond the realm of physical combat. Lee's philosophies offer timeless wisdom for navigating the challenges of life itself. At the heart of Bruce Lee's philosophy lies the concept of balance and harmony. He often spoke about the importance of maintaining a harmonious state of mind and body, emphasizing that true mastery in martial arts and in life comes from this inner equilibrium. He believed that true strength comes from finding equilibrium within ourselves and in our interactions with the world. This balance is not just physical, but also mental and emotional, allowing us to navigate life's challenges with resilience and grace. This means embracing both our masculine and feminine energies, our yin and yang. Bruce Lee often used the symbol of the yin-yang to illustrate the duality of existence and the need to harmonize these opposing forces within us. It's about finding the stillness within the storm, the calm amidst the chaos. In moments of turmoil, Bruce Lee taught that we should seek our inner peace, grounding ourselves in the present and maintaining our composure. 
This balance isn't about achieving a static state of perfection. Instead, it's a dynamic process, a continuous journey of self-discovery and growth. Bruce Lee believed that we must be like water, adaptable and ever-changing. It's about constantly adapting, flowing and finding our center amidst the ever-changing currents of life. Just as water can take the shape of any container, we too must be flexible and open to change, adjusting our approach as circumstances evolve. Just as a dancer moves gracefully between steps, we too must learn to move through life with fluidity and grace, embracing both the challenges and the joys that come our way. Bruce Lee's philosophy encourages us to find beauty in the dance of life, to appreciate each moment as it comes. Embracing both the challenges and the joys that come our way, we learn to grow and evolve. Bruce Lee's teachings remind us that balance and harmony are not destinations but ongoing practices, guiding us towards a more fulfilling and enlightened existence. Modern life often feels like a relentless juggling act. We're bombarded with information, pulled in countless directions, and pressured to do more, be more, achieve more. It's easy to lose sight of what truly matters. We sacrifice sleep for work, relationships for deadlines, and self-care for to-do lists. This constant striving can leave us feeling depleted, disconnected and out of balance. We become so focused on the destination that we forget to enjoy the journey. The pursuit of external validation overshadows the importance of inner peace. We become a society of human doings instead of human beings. The price of an empty well, a personal reflection. I remember a time when I too fell prey to the demands of a fast-paced life. The constant hustle and bustle, the never-ending to-do lists, and the pressure to succeed were overwhelming. As a young entrepreneur and single father, I wore multiple hats, juggling work, parenting, and personal responsibilities. Each day felt like a marathon, and I was always running, trying to keep up with the pace. I was constantly on the go, striving to do it all and be everything to everyone. The demands of my career and the needs of my child left little room for anything else. But in the process, I neglected my own needs. I ignored the signs of burnout, thinking I could push through it. I believed that taking time for myself was a luxury I couldn't afford. I was running on fumes, my inner well running dry. My energy was depleted and my spirit was weary. I felt like an empty vessel with nothing left to give. I was irritable, exhausted and disconnected from myself and those around me. My relationships suffered and my work performance declined. I was a shadow of my former self. It was then I realized that I couldn't pour from an empty cup. I needed to make a change to prioritize my own well-being. I began to understand the importance of self-care and self-compassion. I needed to prioritize my own well-being to refill my own cup in order to show up fully for myself and others. I started to carve out time for activities that nourish my soul like meditation, walks in nature and spending quality time with loved ones. Slowly but surely, I began to feel more balanced, more at peace and more connected to myself and the world around me. Empty your cup. A paradoxical path to fulfillment. This realization led me back to one of my father's most powerful teachings. Empty your cup so that it may be filled. This seemingly paradoxical statement holds the key to unlocking our full potential. It's about letting go of preconceived notions, biases and limiting beliefs. It's about approaching each experience with a beginner's mind, open to new possibilities and perspectives. Emptying our cup isn't about becoming passive or submissive. It's about creating space within ourselves for growth, learning and transformation. It's about recognizing that we don't have all the answers and that true wisdom lies in the willingness to be a student throughout life. From dojo to daily life, the versatility of emptying your cup. In martial arts, emptying your cup is essential for mastering new techniques. A student must be willing to shed old habits and embrace new movements. This requires humility, a willingness to be vulnerable, and a commitment to continuous learning. The same principle applies to life. To embrace new opportunities, we must be willing to let go of what no longer serves us. To connect with others authentically, we must first connect with ourselves. To find peace amidst the chaos, we need to cultivate stillness within. Emptying our cup allows for all of this and more. 
adaptability, flowing with the changes, Bruce Lee famously said, be like water making its way through cracks. Do not be assertive, but adjust to the object and you shall find a way around or through it. This is the essence of adaptability, one of the cornerstones of his philosophy. Life is constantly changing, throwing unexpected challenges our way. It's not about resisting these changes, but about learning to flow with them. Adaptability requires flexibility, both mentally and emotionally. It means letting go of the need to control every outcome and embracing the unknown with courage and curiosity. It's about recognizing that obstacles are not roadblocks, but opportunities for growth and learning. Mindfulness. Finding stillness in the present moment. In the midst of life's whirlwind, it's easy to get caught up in the past or worry about the future. Our mindfulness is about bringing our attention back to the present moment, to the here and now. It's about savoring the simple joys of life, appreciating the beauty that surrounds us, and cultivating a sense of gratitude for what we have. Mindfulness is not about emptying our minds of all thoughts. It's about observing our thoughts and emotions without judgment, acknowledging them without letting them control us. It's about finding a place of stillness within ourselves, a place where we can connect with our inner peace. Vulnerability, the unexpected strength in openness. Vulnerability is often perceived as a weakness, but Bruce Lee recognized it as a source of strength. It takes courage to be vulnerable, to let down our guard and show our true selves to the world. It's about embracing our imperfections, acknowledging our fears and connecting with others on a deeper level. Vulnerability allows us to build authentic connections, to experience true intimacy and to live with greater compassion and empathy. It's about recognizing that we are all interconnected, sharing this human experience with all its joys and sorrows. Embracing the legacy practical steps for everyday living. Integrating Bruce Lee's wisdom into our lives doesn't require grand gestures. It's about making small conscious choices each day. Start by incorporating mindfulness practices into your routine. Take a few minutes each day to sit in stillness, focusing on your breath. Practice gratitude by reflecting on the good things in your life. Embrace adaptability by stepping outside your comfort zone. Try a new activity, challenge your limiting beliefs, and be open to different perspectives. Cultivate vulnerability by sharing your authentic self with others. Express your feelings, ask for help when you need it, and practice forgiveness, both for yourself and others. Be water, my friend, a journey of continuous growth. Bruce Lee's legacy is not a destination, but a journey, a continuous process of growth and self-discovery. It's about embracing the fluidity of life, adapting to the ever-changing currents, and finding our own unique rhythm within the dance. It's about cultivating balance, harmony, and inner peace, not as an end goal, but as a way of being. So I invite you to embody the spirit of Bruce Lee in your own life. Be present, be adaptable, be courageous, be water, my friend. The path to a more fulfilling and meaningful life awaits. Share your experiences with finding balance in the comments and let's inspire each other to grow stronger together. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more powerful insights inspired by Bruce Lee. Your journey toward peaceful power starts now.